Hi there, it's Jim from Janku, and today I want to take a look at how you might set up zooming in and out to your mouse wheel on your desktop computer using Ubuntu 18. Now this is a really helpful trick to use when you're doing video tutorials, so I want to add it to my screen, and let me just go show you how to do that. So if I hit my home screen, it opens up this launcher here, and if I start typing comp is iz, I see this comp is config settings manager. If I click on that, I'll get these settings here and it gives me a warning that this is an advanced tool and I can screw up the configuration of my site. I'm going to say OK. And then where it says Enhance Zoom Desktop, I'm going to click on this and on the Zoom In button I'm going to press Disabled in order to enable it. And I'm going to check that box. And then I'm just going to make my Shift key and choose button 4 for a zoom in. And I'm going to say OK. And now if I hold Shift and I zoom in, you can see that it goes to my mouse here. So I should have actually gone through here and done my zoom out before I did that. So let me just go and configure that as well. So if I come over here and click where it's zoomed out and I press enable and I do shift and I come down here. Okay, so I just set that to shift it allows me to, sh to zoom back out there. <laughs> Let's try that again. Okay, so I was even on the wrong thing. So this was my keyboard here. Let's do the zoom out on our mouse here. So let's come in here and let's press enabled. And let's do shift and let's do this on button 5 and press OK. So now if I hold shift and I scroll in, I can zoom in. And I hold shift, I can scroll to zoom out. Now I can come back here and I can now disable this zoom out key on my keyboard. I don't need that one there. I'm going to unselect shift and then unselect enable and say OK. So there's a good lesson for you. If you're going through this, make sure you set both your zoom in and zoom out buttons before you actually start zooming in because it might be really hard to see what you're doing after you do that. Okay, hopefully this tutorial is helpful and enjoy using this new feature on your Ubuntu 18 laptop. Thanks for watching. Take care.